Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and I learned something today that maybe I never really needed to know because most laser engravers don't use interactive fill. But let's say you've done a special one and you really like it. You, you took some time and you worked with it with the interactive fill tool. You can actually save that and put it later into something else. So let's get the interactive fill tool, click on that. Well, maybe you don't have to click on it because it's picked. Let's pick it get the interactive fill tool and go right up here to fountain fills and go right here to customs. And there's my new fountain fill that I just created. I call it my fill and that's all you have to do. Then you could use that one over and over. So how I did that, just take an ellipse or whatever shape, use your interactive fill tool and make a new fill. We'll just make one real quick. We'll put red. We'll make it a little different. We'll put blue. We'll double click, make a new box. And we'll put a yellow. We'll say, okay, just by clicking off. We'll put another one there. We'll add a little purple. And that's not very pretty, but if you like that, all you have to do is go back to the interactive fill tool, go to, well, you can just go right here because it's already open. And right here is a plus sign. And then it's going to ask you where to put it and its name of it. And I put it in abstract. And I'm just going to name it mine two and hit save. So then there it is right there. So the next time you want to use it, let's make a, a long version of it. Get it back to your interactive fill tool. Click on the fountain fill, go to your new fill, and there it is right there, the one we just created. Now that's at an angle because I must have moved this, but you can get all sorts of different looks with that same fill. Probably needs to be at a right angle, but it matches that. So I thank that person for, uh, she's my, a1 student, she used to bring me apples to my classes. Anyway, hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.